Hi everyone, I'm making a dish here which is going to have chicken and peas in it. It's a Cypriot dish. So I'm browning some onion here in some vegetable oil. And in a separate pan, I'm browning some chicken which has been seasoned with salt and pepper. These are chicken thighs and I've cut them in half. And I'm going to brown about a kilo of chicken thighs. All right, so I've browned my chicken. I only browned it slightly. You don't have to cook it all the way through because it's going to cook more in the pot. And I've added it to my onions and I've also sliced up two small carrots and I've added those too. Now I'm going to add 560 grams of passata, tomato passata. I'm just going to add that in there. And I'm going to add some water as well. So I'm just going to rinse this bottle with water and add that. Okay, um, and a bit more, you want to cover the chicken. Okay, and I'm going to add a kilo of frozen peas. Okay, all right, so now I'm going to also add about half a teaspoon of cinnamon. I may add more later. I'm going to try it and see what it tastes like. And I might add more. And some salt and pepper. So just to taste. All right, so I'm going to switch this back on. And we're going to cook this for about, um, about 10 minutes. And then I'm gonna add some diced potatoes as well. I'm gonna mix this through, put the lid on, cook it for about 10 minutes, and we'll be back soon to add our potatoes. All right, so this has been simmering with the lid on for about 10 minutes now. And you can see that the peas are looking pretty well cooked now. We're just gonna add some some potatoes that I diced up earlier. So I've got here about two large potatoes. In, I've diced those up and I'll just put them in there. Give it another stir and I'm gonna cook it for another 10 to 15 minutes, again with the lid on, and then it should be ready. Just make sure you taste it in the end for salt and pepper. Okay, so this has been simmering now for about 15 minutes and the potatoes are cooked through really nicely. They're nice and tender, so is the chicken and the seasoning is perfect. So we're ready to dish up. I'm gonna serve it in a big bowl and have it with a squeeze of lemon on top and some crusty bread. It's delicious, I hope you enjoy it.